What is happening, y'all? We are back with another episode, and this is going to be episode uh, 52 of Elden Ring. And as you guys remember, if you guys watched the last video, we were in the Caria, the Caria Manor, and look at there's where we were earlier, where that uh, that golden seed was, and that wolf steering out to the, the off the cliff side. And it looks like there's a town below us. I don't know where this is. Oh no, it's the manor. Okay, it just doesn't look like it. That's weird. All right, so we're gonna go down. Um, oh shit! Daddy O's mad. Gotta keep him in this poison plume right here. Oh yeah, dude. Oh yeah. That is what I mean. This magic is freaking awesome. Yeah, this magic is freaking awesome. Living jar shard. You got smashed, my boy. Hell yeah. This, uh, Night Maiden's Mist. Oh, we got a new crack pot. Cool. I think that's so cool how this game does that. So you don't need to keep collecting crack pots as an item to make the, you know, flame pots and poison pots and all that kind of stuff. I think that's cool that the crack pot is just reusable. It's breakable, but it doesn't actually break, and it doesn't disappear. So if you make the item, it just stays there. I think that's how the description went. Matter of fact, I'm going to go and look at that. Uh, container required for crafting crack pot items. The empty pot somehow mends itself when broken. Essential vest for crafting crack pot items. The material and magics, the materials and magics sealed within de deploy their effects when pot is thrown. Yeah, the empty pot is somehow mends itself when broken. That's that's crazy. So like when you throw it, it just becomes a crack pot in your inventory again, which is freaking crazy. Like that's so cool. All right. Um. Yeah, it makes the need for finding them, like, not so great because you know that you can just use it again and again and again. Alright, there's another big one over there. So, just before we go down there, let's bulk up on magic. Wish we could summon right now. I still can't get over this guy's armor. This guy's armor's the shit. It's kind of like two people are standing together. Okay. So let's go. Oh, there's two of them. Come on. There you go. Alright, let's get all these little guys together.
Come on. Dang it. I was hoping you would have gotten in that poison plume. Yeah, dude, that's such useful magic. That Night Maiden's Mist is overpowered. Okay, so we keep dropping down. Oh, okay, that's how we get that item over there. All right. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, I was like, is that tree moving? I was like, it is moving, but it's the wind. I thought it was something else. I was like, is that a tree monster? Okay, so best area to drop down, I guess, is just wherever. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> Did not want to walk off and not make that. <gasps> Ashabor carrying grandeur. <sighs> oh, we made it. There's no point in making it, though, really. There's absolutely no point in making it. But yeah, dropping down here will kill us. So let's go this way. And then we'll... Actually, you know what? We don't need to. We'll go to the upper level right here. And we'll just sneak past all those dudes. We'll also level up, because we need to level up. And then we'll pop a, uh, a rune arc, too, to buff our level a little bit. Oh, perfect. Alright, so we've raised our vigor. Um, our dexterity is at 30. Our vigor is at 30. Our intelligence is at 20. Strength at 20. We need our endurance at at least 25. So we'll buff. Once we get 30 vigor, 25 endurance, 20 strength, 20 dex or 30 dexterity, 20 intelligence. Um, then we'll start working on mind, I think. Because we, if we pop a rune arc... It increases everything by five. So we'll have 35 vigor, uh, 30 endurance, uh, 25 strength, 35 dexterity, uh, 25 intelligence, 13 faith, and 13 arcane, which doesn't really matter because those really aren't. Eh. You know what, actually? A cumulative figure that represents overall attributes, uh, attribute strength. You can level up by using... Yeah, well, duh. Okay, so it's item discovery and just overall uh, evolution. So Arcane, I guess, is just like any other thing, except it's just basically for item discovery and your overall stats, which is not that great. I mean, that's why I'm not going to touch it. Let's see. Um, what we got in our chest? Raw meat dumpling? We'll do auto refill on. So once we use an item, it'll automatically go back. Uh, if we have it in, in storage, it'll automatically go straight into our thing. Now let's see. Cool. Oh, look, it's daytime now. Wasn't he going the other way before? Oh, you know what? I'm gonna have to pop. Alright, y'all. Look at him. He is pissed. Just enough. <laughs> that was epic. Oh, another thing that I need to do is I need to switch my armor. I need to use the scaled armor. <laughs> <clears throat> Ooh, I went and got 
more snacks from Harmons today, and I got these cookie tarts, the rasp you know those like shortbread cookies that have that well in the middle, and it's that raspberry jam, yeah, I got these ones, but you remember like those cookies that you get from like those tins that had these in there, and they were like rubbery, dude, these ones are like so fresh the jelly is like fresh and like soft and it's it's like it was just made mm. i love shortbread raspberry cookies Where's that guy? He was here right, like, last time. Super weird. There's a beetle somewhere. Okay. Mmm. My god. These cookies smack. Mm. Oh, you know what these crystal buds are for? Making cuckoo stones. What? Freezing pot? Heck yeah. We got a freezing pot now. We got freezing grease. Or maybe we already had that. Mm. So we got fire, magic, holy, blood, freezing, dragon, a booyah. But we don't have the dragon uh, drawstring or the freezing drawstring blood uh, greases. That looks so weird. It looks like can a candle. That one just looks eh. This one looked crazy. That actually looks like raisin. Uh, anything else that it gave us? Like freezing arrows or something? <laughs> no, uh, nothing like that. Alright, well. We got uh, such a big variety of arrows that we can craft. Uh, cracked crystals and crystal buds. Okay, so making more of these makes sense. So we'll make some more of those. Freezing pots, uh, rimmed crystal buds, so that's what they're for. A freezing pot. 
Wait, is this made from a ritual pot? Yeah. It's made from a ritual pot. Throw enemies to cause buildup of frost. <clears throat> Throw to douse enemy with accursed blood. A luring pot. Uses FP throw it to lure foes of human build only. Beast build. Roped fire pot. These are for throwing behind you. Like there's an enemy behind you. Alright, so we did that. Um, I'm not so sure about this enemy that we're about to face. But it can't hurt. Well, that's only one. I was going to say, it can't hurt to have stuff like that. Mm. Yeah, let's go ahead and do a couple of those. Uh, let's do one of these and one of these. Oh, no, no, no. I meant to do this one and that one. Alright. Three of those. Make two of those. Uh, let's make one of these. Eh, let's make two of them. We got a lot of turtleneck meat. <coughs> Okay, so let's equip some stuff real quick. Um, well, I don't even know if we need to equip that. I mean, I guess we can. Put this one. Wait, I thought I made more of this one. Alright, let's go ahead and make more of that one real quick. Okay, we got seven of these. I'm not sure if magic is the best one to use against this boss, but we're going to go with it anyway. Go with lightning. Alright, we're going to summon, and then we're just going to, you know. Um, I don't know if this boss does magic, but... Mm. Actually, no. Let's not equip that. Let's equip this. <coughs> and instead of equipping both of those, we'll just use them. Frozen. Lightning. Let's go ahead and equip the magic as well, just in case. Uh, let's see. Anything else? No? Okay, so let's go in our inventory. And we'll... Should we summon the wolves? Or should we do an ancestral follower? Okay, we got giant rats. Doesn't cost anything to summon the giant rats? That's cool. It's only the rats. Okay, that's a cool ash of war. Or, uh... <clears throat> spirit ashes. Wait, we can't use it right now? Oh, we're not close enough. That was weird. We could use it when we were down there. Dirty Sanchez. Made me waste a healing. Damn, are we not going to be able to summon in here? Let's go ahead and equip this just in case we can. Um, we're not going to need this anymore, so let's go ahead and put that back. Uh, raise the stamina recovery. Use faith. Previous lightning, non damage negation. I don't know even I don't even know what kind of a fight we're going into with this, but let's uh, go ahead and pop a rune arc. 
make it super tough. Because this is a boss fight in here, ladies and gentlemen. And other friends. Oh my gosh. Are we gonna have to go to this boss cave? This is a, this has gotta be the boss fight right here. Oh Royal Knight Loretta. What? She can use a horse. Oh phalanx. in that poison cloud. Yeah! Dude, I'm telling you guys. Loretta's great bow. Oh, we got that? Hell yeah! I cannot believe that's the freaking magic uh, giant bow thing that that one uh, mage was shooting at us inside that library. Hell yeah. Well, let's progress. That did not take a whole lot of effort, man. I'm telling you, that freaking Night Maiden's Mist shit hits hard. <clears throat> Three sisters. Uh, I'm kind of scared. Is this where we're going to find, uh, what's her name? Oh, we can ride a horse in here? Don't tell me we could have rode a horse in that fight. Oh, no, we couldn't have. Oh, that's cool, though. We're in the backside of the... Oh, okay, so we're outside of the castle now. That shit is dope. Oh, I heard it. Is that a dragon? Okay, there's got to be some kind of uh, cellar in here, right? This is a rune, isn't it? No, a ruin, not rune. Oh, I thought it was. This was type a type of ruin where they would have like a cellar. Yeah, there's a fucking dragon right there. Not looking forward to fighting a dragon. I mean, we've got that magic, uh, Night Maiden's Mist. That shit hits hard. Yeah, this should be some type of, um, ruins. Let's investigate this area a little bit before we venture over to Dragon and start trying to fight him. Because I can tell you now, it is not going to be a fun fight, fighting that dragon. Some of you may die, but that is a sacrifice I'm willing to make. Someone can tell me 
what movie that is from, then I will be super duper excited and happy that you made uh, the right guess. Bye bye. Bye bye. Damn, there's like a whole other freaking part of this level. Don't tell me I could have gone around this whole place. Could I? Yeah, probably. Oh, look at Grace. Cool. Alright, so this might be the Grace. No, nah, the last Grace that we were at right here. Royal moon gazing thing. That's the one we're gonna have to go from, uh, go from to fight the dragon. Grave violet. Grave glove war. Oh, there's more glove wart. Root resin, hell yeah. shard. There are these ugly things that are walking around. Frickin' Shrek cousin looking motherfuckers. What the hell's that? Oh, it's the uh, painter thing. Juvenile scholar cap. Yeah, it was a painting uh, guy. Hell yeah, we found one of the painting things. You guys are weak. Albaneric blood clot. What the fuck? This one doing cartwheels? Albaneric ashes. Cool. This one was doing freaking somersaults and shit out of here. Like, look at me. Funny, funny guys. Dirty chain mail. Look, more root resin. Root resin is a rare freaking item, man. They're only in certain areas. Oh, there's more. You can find them near, uh, underground near the roots of the herb trees, or you can find them on the surface near the roots of herb trees, or I guess in graveyards. I didn't know you could find them in graveyards. Shit, those things are freaking useful. Is that, uh... Is that Radigan? That is Radigan. Gotcha. Yeah, that was Radigan. Even though we've already beat Radigan, that was Radigan again.
Back the fuck up. Whoa, whoa, what did we just pick up? Michaela's uh, lilies. These are also rare items, guys. Notice how, like, I've gone and needed money, and I will sell off some of my um, items. I will never sell off Michaela's lilies, Trina's lilies, or, uh, like, root resin and other exceedingly rare items. And it'll tell you what the rare items are. It'll say, oh, this is an exceedingly rare item. Which means... Uh, there might be a limited number of them in the game because they don't respawn after you pick them up and go to like uh, a grace and then come back to that exact same area. Those items won't, will no longer be there. So be wary of that. Oh, is this another Evergale? Yup. Royal Grave Evergale. Okay, cool. All right. If you guys couldn't tell. For this video, we're kind of just exploring right now. That fall will kill you. Beware. Oh, it looks like there's another one. What the hell is that? I want to know what that is. What's over here? Oh, I know what that is. All right, all right. But I don't know what that is right there. We're actually going to use our uh, telescope. Oh, it's just a bunch of the monument things. Uh, our grave things. <gasps> Why did I do that? Oh, God, I'm an idiot. Oh my God, look at all those runes. Jesus. second we'll go back over there <laughs> all right sorry guys it's about to get a little crunchy up in here We missed one. I don't know. Root resin, I think, reappears. Mm-hmm. It reappears. Which is lucky. Oh, so do these. Grave violets. I still don't know what these gray violets are for. We're just going around collecting some items real quick. <clears throat> this is the perfect weapon to be using on a horse. Because it has reach. And a nice stabbing, thrusting motion. Oh, look, a glove wart we missed. Or a grave, yeah, a grave glove wart.
Okay. Got our, uh, I almost said souls again. We got our runes back. And almost 20,000 runes. That would be a shame to lose that. Three root resins in one place. Nice. Ooh. An Arteria flower. Or leaf, sorry. So Arterias are also a rare item. Okay, so that's the gate to um the city. To the yeah. To the realm of the Erd tree. Okay. Um yeah, so we found an Evergale. Let's uh real quick, cause we're gonna discover whatever's over in this area. We'll go back to the Royal Moon Gazing Grounds. Forgot. I got a little food hack for you guys. The best way to enjoy a cup of soup, and you know when like when you finish your soup, you got all that broth and it's hot, and you gotta wait for it to cool down and before you start sipping it, because that's like the best way to eat ramen is just you know eat all the noodles before they get soggy and really really soft. <clears throat> then you just casually sip on that nice flavorful broth. Don't even don't even tell me that cup of soup does not smack hard. That is like my all time favorite like food to eat is ramen, and I eat at least a cup of ramen a day. Sometimes too. I mean, if I'm feeling really hungry and unsatisfied, I'll eat another cup. Okay. Oh, Rena's Rise. Rena's Re Rise. Okay, Rena's Rise. Um, let's see. Blocked shut for now. Yeah. Okay, Rena. Rena. Rena's Rise. Isn't that um, who we were? Um, or is Rainy? That's who we're looking for. We're we're, we're looking for Rainy. The daughter of, uh, the, the daughter of, um, what's it called? We, uh, Renella. So we got Renella and Rainy. And look at that. There's some glowing and shit in there. She's probably doing some magic or something. Because she is a witch. She made that abundantly clear. I, I don't know why Rena's... Renna's Rise is closed right now. I mean, we'll probably have to defeat that fucking dragon. Possibly. There's another one over there. Okay, so there's two. Let's try to sneak past Mr. Dragon. Or Mrs. Dragon. Yeah, fighting that dragon's gonna be tough. I wonder if these are ruins and if there's like a little thing we can go down. Aw oh, shit, Glenstone Dragon Adula. Damn, I did not mean for that guy to see me. Rainy's Rise, here we go. This is what we needed. We needed Rainy's Rise so we can talk to Rainy. Think she's in here? Maybe that other Rise, Rena, is uh, gonna be. <clears throat> Maybe it'll be unlocked if we um, defeat that dragon. <clears throat> Damn. <clears throat> Let's 
see. Okay, she's got to be in here. Going up. Okay, but where is that? Ah, yes. E.G., my war counselor, and Salavis, preceptor in the sorcerer's arts, can be found below. Like thee, they are in my service. Heed not their peculiarities. Feel secure in gaining from them what advantage thou canst. I am sure the others will be doing just the same. Ah, yes. Like the heat not there. I'm sure. Alright, bet. So now, this is her quest line. Rena and Rainy. I think they're two of the same... Two people of the same body. Or, as you can see, she looked like she had another face. And she had t uh, four arms. So I'm assuming... Because she said, oh, I last... When we last met, I said my name was Rena. My name is Rainy. Oh, shit. This guy... Okay, uh, isn't there supposed to be another person? Or am I tripping? Yeah, he's, she said E.G. and uh, Selena or some other type of name. But I see... Oh, there we go. The Preceptor. Is your mouth yes. sound shut? Yes, I've heard all about you. I am Salavis, preceptor in the sorcerer's arts. Oh, it's just covered. I don't know what it is the mistress sees in a provincial tarnished like you. But since we have the misfortune of serving the same lady, I ask that you kindly try not to drag us all down with you. Fuck you. I reside. Should you wish to be of act? If it were up to me, I wouldn't waste my time. But who am I to... Okay, so... Rena's other tower. That's what we're... Why we couldn't get in there. <clears throat> so we don't... Why am I... Why 
Why can't I get out of here now? Okay, um, we can't seem to get out of the tower. Now we're trapped in here. <coughs> oh look. Green as Lily. Why can't we exit? Why can't we exit now? Let us give all that together. That's so weird. Why can't we leave? Why did it say your video clip is saved? Open... That was weird. Why can't we leave? Ah, allow me to forewarn. I shall soon enter my slumber. And it will be some time before I wake. This doll's body is not without its hindrances. Still, I have high hopes for thee. I look forward to the good news when I arise. I shall soon enter my slumber, and it will be some time before I wake. I have high hopes for thee. I look forward to the good news when I arise. Oh, she's in a doll's body? That's weird. I was like, why does she look like she's falling apart? Okay, now it... I was like, why is that? Now it looks like we can leave. Because before we had that Golden Order thing saying we couldn't uh, do any harm. Now it's not there. Mm. Big dude's gone. So a smart ass. Alright, so we need to find out where that uh thing fell in Limgrave. And we need to pay a visit to the lost city. Block shut for now. 
He literally said, come pay me a visit, or unless it's that one over there. Hmm, it's down below. Wait, where is this? There's an item down there. Ah, there's the beetle. Oh, it's a cerulean beetle. It looks like there's ruins over here. I wonder if this is... Oh, I thought I saw it. I'm looking for the... Oh, look! An arteria leaf. I was hoping that there would be a cellar over here. And a treasure in it. <coughs> Dude, my headache has not really subsided at all. Well, well, you took me at my word. Did you not realize I was merely being polite? Oh, you provincials never cease to amaze. Uh, perhaps I'll give you some. I'd like you to find a woman called Nefeli to administer a potion. Even you can do that. Good. Good. Now I shall hand over the potion in question. Celibus's potion. Find Nefeli and ensure she drinks it. I expect glad tidings. And... Okay, where the fuck is she supposed to be? Thanks for telling me, like, any sort of useful information. Memory stone, yay! Dude, I wonder how many there are in this game. Usually, it was uh, an old, it was an attribute that you had to raise. Oh, look, an item. Yeah, usually it's an attribute in Dark Souls games. Oh, the Black Wolf Mask, gangster. Sorry, I was in the middle of explaining something, and I totally just got sidetracked. And that's what ADD is. There's stairs right there, leading to nothing? Oh, sorry, anyway, um... What was I... I, oh, so usually in Dark Souls, that's an attribute you have to raise to, um... Raise your, um... It's called attunement. That's what the, uh, attribute was called. It was called attunement. And if for those of you OG Dark Souls players, you know what I, exactly what I'm talking about. If you did a magic build, you had to raise your vigor, endurance, attunement, and your intelligence to be able to use magic. Because if you didn't raise your attunement, you couldn't use uh, certain spells. Because this game, it doesn't require multiple spell slots to use one uh, particular spell. Like in other Dark Souls games, if it was a really, like, high-level spell, it required three attunement slots. Which means, in this game, you need, uh, if you only start out with one, uh, spell slot, you needed to find two of these memory stones to be able to use that one spell. Thank God it's not like that. 
Now that would be really annoying. All right, guys, we are actually gonna try and and uh, fight this thing. Oh, you know what? Hold on. Okay, we don't have enough uh, to level up or uh, pop runes to level up. So we're gonna try. Shit. Oh shit, I didn't mean to throw that. Wiped out my wolves. Where'd he go? Oh, he... Are you kidding me? Oh, shit. Dude, stop fucking moving away from my spells. Don't you know I'm trying to kill you? You killed my wolfies. Is this thing magically just appearing and disappearing? Where the hell did this dragon go? It's gone. What, is this thing playing hide and seek with me now? Dude, the dragon's gone. 